Google Drive is one of the handiest cloud services around today, thanks to its integration with your already existing Google account and affordable prices for expanding your storage. While sharing files with another account is easy, moving your files to a new Google account is a bit more complicated. If you're looking to move your files from one account to another without having to download gigabytes of data, here's what you need to do. The easiest way to manage two accounts at once would be to use Google's desktop site, so grab your laptop and let's get started. Just log into the Google Drive account you want to transfer files out of. If you're transferring multiple files, you'd want to move everything you want to transfer into one single folder. However, if you want to transfer all the contents of the folder in one go, there shouldn't be any folders inside that single folder you've created for your transfer. This is due to how Google handles folder sharing and owner transfership on Google Drive. Transferring ownership of a folder will only transfer the ownership of that folder itself and not its contents. So if you need to transfer folders unchanged and can't empty their contents into the main folder, you'll need to repeat the following process for all files within the folder and any subfolders within. Once you've gathered everything in one folder, open the folder in Google Drive and hold Ctrl and A on Windows or Command and A on Mac to select all of the contents of the entire folder. Right click on any file or document while everything is selected and click on share. Then type in and select the account you want to transfer to. Click on send when you're finished. It's important to note that this method can only be used with files created using Google's office tools. That being said, to transfer ownership, just right click again, click share, then click on the drop down menu next to the account you want to transfer the files to. Click on make owner and confirm your choice. Repeat this process for any subfolders within this folder. Once that's done, you can finish the transfer by having the new owner account remove your old account's access using the same process, choosing remove rather than make owner. To transfer any non-native documents, you'll have to compile them into a separate folder and download it. Once that's done, you can unzip the files into a folder, then re-upload them to a new drive. After making sure everything has been safely uploaded to your new drive account, feel free to delete the folder and your old one. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Google Drive and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.